Use this play down in the red zone for easy reads and easy touchdowns. Coming up next. Hey, this is Full Game Prometheus, the only YouTuber that gives you full games of all the tips and schemes I post on my channel. I'll show you the good, the bad, and the uglier. So guys, if you're new to my channel, make sure you hit the subscribe button, also that notification icon so you can never miss an upload. So guys, I'm going to show you my controller um, in this uh, in, when I'm setting this up. Uh, one of the things I want to tell you is that this play, flanker corner, is really good in the red zone, right around the five-yard line or so, uh, pri uh, primarily because it's going to offer you multiple different options to hit your opponent in, in different areas of, of the red zone, where it's going to make it very difficult from the user your choices now this this play also is in the Packers uh, so it's in the, the the Cowboys and the Packers playbooks so basically this is the play uh, it is uh, going to be the flanker corner um, I'm gonna make make you make basically two different adjustments with the sticker play I'm gonna go ahead and take uh, Beasley I'm gonna put him on a little out route uh, so it's standard out route that's why five yards depth is very important the way this play sets up and I'm gonna go ahead and take Hearns and actually put him on a slant route giving me um, a third read or check down where I can hit my opponent over the middle now uh, the way I make my progressions and reads is from left to right so I'll be looking at Beasley then Cooper and then I'll drop it down the Hearns and potentially Schwamm with this particular play. Elliott's route which is a table route which is very effective in this game is not a route I'm looking at. Uh, it's just going to pull defenders down and actually go ahead and give me an opportunity to hit Cooper or maybe Hearns on the back end. So my first read is going to be uh, Beasley. I'm going to look to see if the defender actually, fl uh, actually uh, defends him. And if the defender doesn't defend him, he doesn't follow him to the outs or get inside and pay, play the sideline, I'm just going to go ahead and just rifle that ball for an easy completion. So you can see I'm picking up seven, uh, eight yards right there on an easy touchdown if he doesn't defend it. So that's an easy completion if, if the defender doesn't defend it at all. And once we're going to set this up, we're going to go ahead and take Beasley, going to go ahead and put him off on um, a little uh, out route, take Hearns and put him out on a slant route and then make our progressions from there. Now, the next area of the field I'm gonna look at is I'm gonna go ahead and look at this wide receiver uh, right here, which is gonna be Cooper. I'm gonna highball the pass. So uh, to highball a pass, basically what you're gonna do is you're gonna go ahead um, and uh, uh, hold your left bumper, uh, which you can see is on the icon, and then you're just gonna go ahead and, and, and push up on your stick and then uh, hit your passing icon. So let's just see if we can get the type of <clears throat> coverage we can on this. So this is the high ball right here. Uh, so you can see that he actually got an animation. I got rid of the ball a little bit later than usual. You want to try to get him as he's turning around. Um, that's going to be the ideal situation. Also get that single coverage and you should be able to get some pretty good animation right there to get an easy touchdown. That would be your next progression if a, a defender actually plays a route. Now the back side, I've got another high ball opportunity with this slant. So this is what's cool about this particular play is that uh, you're going to give your opponent the look. Uh, you've got two opportunities to hit him off uh, on the far left hand side of the field and then you've got an opportunity to hit him over, over the, the back side right here. Uh, with a nice little high ball pass with the slant. So attacks three different areas against your, your opponent. And it's very di very difficult to stop with your user. You really can't be in all those areas at once. So once again, my subscribers, thank you for your support, guys. If you do like these tips, make sure you smash that like button. And until next time.